There's news, there's sense and there's nuisance and boy does this show have plenty of that last bit. Non-vegetarian logo ka soya hai chicken. Non-vegetarian logo ka soya hai chicken. ये क्या कह दिया रणबीर इस एक सेंटेंस से कितने लोगों की भावनाएं हर्ट हो सकती हैं? चिकन की सोया की नॉन वेजिटेरियंस की वेजिटेरियंस की हिंदू समाज की कोई परवाह नहीं है तुम्हें रणबीर आई जस्ट वॉन्ट यू टू लुक एट दिस न्यूज शो न्यूज शो ऑन जी न्यूज मिड वीक ऑन वेडनेसडे एंड जस्ट थिंक अबाउट वे योर कंट्रीज गोइंग द टाइटल ऑफ द डिबेट शो इज बीफ पे ब्रह्मास्त्र The eminent panels brought on board to discuss this eminent topic are a Karni Sena loose mouth, a wannabe Islamic scholar, a random political commentator, and another Dharam guru. Because uh, why not? All of them giving tippani on Ranbir's 11 saal purani food habits. Usko pasand hai beef. Hamko jute pasand hai. Ham jute maarne mein maayre hai. Agar koi Hindu dharam kar Hindu aasthao ka apman karega, to ham bhi jute maar sakte hai. This is the day when income tax raided one of the country's most independent think tanks Center for Policy Research which has been more than critical of the Modi government the IT department also surveyed the independent and public spirited media foundation which helps digital media organizations with funds incidentally it's also been one year since news laundry offices were surveyed by the IT department while independent organizations whose journalist and thinkers do more than just ask modi ji aap aam kaise khate hain while those guys are being systematically harassed by the central government agencies the nation is busy discussing ranbir ka beef love 11 saal pehle bola ki wo red meat ka fan hai beef ka fan hai mandir nahi jaane denge वैसे सोचने वाली बात है कि भाई ये कौन लोग हैं जो इंटरनेट में सर्च कर करके पुराने वीडियोस ढूंढ ढूंढ के हर्ट होते हैं हर रोज आ, आज तो मैं बहुत ही खुश और बेहतर महसूस कर रहा हूँ पर शिट मुझे तो ऑपरेज करना है मुझे तो गुस्सा आना है मुझे तो ऑफेंड होना है आ, कोई है भाई कोई है बुक क्यों टिकेट फॉर हम मास्टरा ना मिल गया बकरा कुछ नहीं है यार ये तो अरे यार क्या ये फीकी चीजें अरे मोदी जी के साथ फोटो तो खिंचाई है इसने अरे यार <laughs> मिल गया बकरा आई फील चिकन इज द सोया फूड ऑफ नॉन वेजिटेरियन आई एम मटन पाया बीफ रेड मीट रेड मीट आई एम अ बिग बीफ का है Can you believe that it was okay at one point in India for an actor to say this on Times Now and get away with it? Today, the same channel's anchors lack the moral courage to call out this bullshit for what it is—an indulgent, pathetic monkey balancing. The argument is just like they have the right to go to the temple and say that you consume beef or you like beef. People who may be hurt by this have the right to protest. ये कहाँ लिखा हुआ है कि अगर आपने 11 साल पहले कभी बीफ खाया है आप महाकाल के दर्शन नहीं कर सकते? Isn't it bizarre that some statement made 11 years ago is picked up and somebody is not allowed to do darshan of Shiv ji? Navika and Padmaja took very progressive stances on Ranbir eating beef. but with a caveat that bhai he only did this 11 years ago why are you talking about it now what's the problem today 2014 ke baad modi ji ke india mein to nahi khaya na so progressive the careful tiptoeing on ranbir's beef eating and temple hopping is not surprising at all after all anchors of this very channel have run programs that have fed the hashtag boycott bollywood beef i mean beast and that brings us to the main issue i want to discuss this week the attack on bollywood and cricket by television news these are two fields that truly unite india that bring us together in a cinema hall or a sporting stadium that help us look beyond our petty differences and truly rise above hindu muslim shaadi ab real life mein to love jihad ban gayi hai but in bollywood movies we still root for mixed couples If you switch on television news then you will be told to look at every muslim with suspicion you should look at protesting farmers with suspicion like khalistanis but cricket tells us that you can trust hindus muslims or sikhs a sportsman at the end of the day to bat for team india 
there's one more thing that sports and performing arts teach us, which is that despite your differences, you can appreciate someone in the other team when they do well. So when Pakistan has a good day on the cricket field, you may feel very bad for the team you're rooting for. But you have the grace and the big heartedness to say, well played. And you can appreciate a good match between two good teams. Lekin itni bon homi, itna badappan, itni ekta. Ye TV news walo ko kaha pachegi? Cricket match, Sudhir edition. पाकिस्तान की क्रिकेट टीम के लिए यह सिर्फ एक मैच नहीं था बल्कि यह एक युद्ध की तरह था पाकिस्तान के लिए मैच नहीं बल्कि एक युद्ध होता है यह एक युद्ध है और इसे हर कीमत पर जीतना है हर मैच को युद्ध वो हर कीमत पर उस युद्ध को जीतना चाहते हैं उसे युद्ध मानकर जीतना चाहते हैं यह नए जमाने का युद्ध है जिसे हम फिफ्थ जनरेशन वॉरफेयर कहते हैं फिफ्थ जनरेशन वॉरफेयर ट्रस्ट सुधीर टू रूइन एवरी सोर्स ऑफ जॉय इन दिस कंट्री क्या वैसे ही हमारी लड़ाइया कम है जो तुम क्रिकेट में भी युद्ध डाल रहे हो नाउ वी ऑल नो दैट एशिया कप 2022 इज गोइंग ऑन एंड अनफॉर्चुनेटली इंडिया इज इन ऑल लाइकलीहुड आउट ऑफ द कॉन्टेस्ट लेकिन पहले मैच में तो हमने पाकिस्तान को धूल चटा दी थी मजा चटा दिया था फिर क्या था सेकेंड मैच के लिए न्यूज एंकर ऑल रेडी पिछले रविवार पाकिस्तान को पीटा इस बार फिर से टीम इंडिया जीतेगी पाकिस्तान को पहले मैच में हराया था आज फिर हराएंगे क्योंकि भारत सिर्फ जोश के साथ नहीं खेलता बल्कि सटीक रणनीति के साथ मैदान पर उतरता है इस बार भी रविवार है और ये रविवार भी जीत का ही बार होगा और अब की बार पाकिस्तान टीम को मैच ऐसी पहले अल्लाह याद आने लगे An India-Pakistan match is always high stakes, which is what makes it thrilling, which is what makes it fun. And our boys did put up a good game. Maze dar match chal raha tha, but then a missed catch here, a few wickets there, and we ended up losing the match. Which is technically what happens in a game, you know. You win sometimes, you lose sometimes. But ab ye news anchors ko kaun samjhaye? India lost the match, and some of our Indian news anchors lost their gerat. Gerat, big gerat. Get it? India versus Park. Kalti kiski? Ek catch ki kiyat. Tum kya jo? Har ka guna kar kon? Ashdeep ne itni dolly catch girai hai na. Iski to maafi nahi banti bhai. Match ka mujri magar dekha jaye to wo Rishabh Pant ka ganda shot tha. Match ka mujri magar dekha jaye to wo Rishabh Pant ka ganda shot. I can understand Indian cricket team fans getting upset and even angry when Team India doesn't put its best performance out there. But news channels ke anchors ki tippani mujhe bilkul nahi pachti. Matlab ye log jo din raat desh ko baatne ka kaam karte hain with Aman and Amish type chin tools, ye channel jiska desh hit se dur dur tak koi taluk nahi hai, they truly don't have the right to shame the Indian cricket team on a bad day because these guys haven't had a good day in their profession in a very long time. But wait till you hear the analysis of Amish or Aman ke Sardar Sudhir Chaudhary. Just listen to what he said after Team India lost. Half of the Indian players are billionaires. Indian players travel in private jets, have lavish lifestyles, and are superstars. Yet Pakistani players pull off victories over us. because they are fueled by the hatred and revenge against India they will sacrifice a world cup just to defeat india for indian players it's just another game of cricket but for pakistanis it's a game of life and death and their pride that's why we let it go and pakistanis fight till the last ball what can you expect from someone whose entire career hinges on spreading hatred and division when you have come on prime time news show every night to sow hatred you can't be blamed for thinking that hate is actually what makes the whole world go around by the way sudhir ji what happens when sri lanka defeats india is that also because they are driven by hatred for india buddhist nation war against hindu nation sudhir ko is post ke liye kafi trolling mili so any normal person in his position would have thought ki bhai chalo गलत मौके पे चौका मारा आई शुड जस्ट लेट माई ट्विटर एनालिसिस डाइट्स ट्विटर डेथ बट नो सुधीर केम ऑन प्राइम टाइम टीवी द वेरी नेक्स्ट डे एंड ऑफर द सेम ट्विटर ज्ञान ऑन टीवी न्यूज भारत के खिलाफ होने वाला हर क्रिकेट मैच पाकिस्तान के लिए मैच नहीं बल्कि एक युद्ध होता है और वो इसी मंशा के साथ उसमें उतरते हैं कि ये एक युद्ध है और इसे हर कीमत पर जीतना है वो इसे युद्ध मानते हुए आगे बढ़ते हैं और हर मैच को युद्ध मानकर जब वो खेलने के लिए उतरते हैं 
तो उनकी पूरी जो बॉडी लैंग्वेज होती है वो इस तरह की होती है कि न जाने वो भारत से किस बात का बदला लेना चाहते हैं और वो हर कीमत पर उस युद्ध को जीतना चाहते हैं मैच नहीं जीतना चाहते उसे युद्ध मानकर जीतना चाहते थैंक गॉड ही स्टेप टू युद्ध एंड यूज One hour after India lost the match, Arshdeep's Wikipedia page was vandalized. His name was changed to Major Arshdeep Singh Langra. The edit described Singh as a Khalistani cricketer who was named in Khalistan squad. His national side was edited to Khalistan Punjab. Wikipedia officials told News Laundry that the user who vandalized Arshdeep's page was probably located somewhere in the Pakistani city of Mari. About 90 kilometers away from Rawalpindi, another Wikipedia page of Arshdeep Singh, a goalkeeper for Goa, was also vandalized. The footballer's place of birth was edited to Chandigarh, Khalistan. News Laundry reported that the user who made these edits could be based out of India, and their ISP's reliance due. The same user also vandalized the Wikipedia page of another Indian footballer named Arshdeep Singh and changed. His place of birth to Chandigarh, Khalistan as well. मतलब नेट नेट सरहद के इस पार और उस पार काफी चोमू रहते हैं मीन वाइल अलॉन्ग विद पाकिस्तानी हैंडल्स फिशिंग फॉर ट्रबल इन इंडिया ऑल्ट न्यूज रिपोर्टेड दैट सम ऑफ द ट्रोलिंग अर्शदीप रिसीव ऑन ट्विटर वॉज इन डीड बाई इंडियन यूजर्स इट्स नॉट सरप्राइजिंग बिकॉज ऑन द इंटरनेट यू हैव ऑल सॉर्ट्स ऑफ पीपल If someone can issue a rape and death threat to a baby girl for how her father performs in a match. then calling arshdeep a khalistani spa for the course news channels conveniently ignored the ghar ka mail to dho the neighbor ka dag and of course attack anti national wikipedia we have to teach wikipedia a lesson we have to ban wikipedia wikipedia is not neutral wikipedia is anti india wikipedia is politically biased wikipedia so represents Indian. prejudice they hate anything that is indian of indian origin they hate it arnab ka dard hum samajh sakte hain just look at his wiki entry goswami and his style of journalism has been subject to massive criticism he has been noted for his opinionated reporting in support of bhartiya janata party and hindutva across a wide spectrum of situations including by uncritical reproduction of government narratives avoiding criticism of figures from the ruling party bjp and presenting political opponents in a negative light In a show on Republic TV on 18 September 2021, Goswami claimed that Pakistani ISI agents were staying on the fifth floor of the Serena Hotel in Kabul and abetting Afghan Taliban fighters in Panjshir. In reality, the hotel had only two floors. Oops. Uh chalo chalo uh jaldi jaldi let's move on uh Khalistaniyon ki baat karte hain. Pakistan ki khufi agency ISI uske neta, uske patrakar aur Khalistan ko lekar jo alag alag duniya bhar mein sangathan hain वो सब मिलकर खालिस्तानी संगठनों के साथ मिलकर धर्म के बल्ले से भारत के खिलाफ नफरत की जबरदस्त बैटिंग कर रहे थे जो डिजिटल आतंकवाद जो पाकिस्तान में बैठे कुछ आतंकवादियों का नापाक एजेंडा है हिंदुस्तान के खिलाफ उसी को आगे बढ़ाने के नापाक मंसूबे नजर आए सर तो हम और आप तो सोच भी नहीं सकते कि ये खिलाड़ी के कैच छोड़ने पर उसका नाम खालिस्तान से जोड़ा जा सकता है लेकिन पाकिस्तान की खुफिया एजेंसी आईएसआई कुछ भी सोच सकती है और यकीन मानिए कुछ भी कर सकती है आईएसआई की साजिश ये थी कि किसान आंदोलन को किसी तरह खालिस्तान आंदोलन बना दिया जाए आईएसआई की साजिश ये थी कि किसान आंदोलन को किसी तरह खालिस्तान आंदोलन बना दिया जाए किसान आंदोलन को खालिस्तानी बोलना आई की साजिश तो थी बट गेस हु इंडियन एजेंट्स वर आर टॉप इंडियन न्यूज एंकर इस आंदोलन में अब खालिस्तान की एंट्री हो चुकी है इस आंदोलन में अब खालिस्तानी एलिमेंट्स की एंट्री हो चुकी है लुक्स लाइक जी न्यूज सफर्स फ्रॉम शॉर्ट टर्म मेमोरी लॉस नाउ देर इज वन थिंग इंपॉर्टेंट टू नोट आई डोंट थिंक पीपल हु अब्यूज अर्शदीप आर रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ऑफ क्रिकेट और स्पोर्ट फैंस फोगेट टीम इंडिया फैंस These guys are low-level trolls who've been empowered to say whatever they like because they know they can get away with it, and they say it because the public discourse in our country today has reached an all-time low, and news channels have played a huge role, a mega, major, starring role in lowering public discourse. When prime time star anchors don't think twice before calling protesting farmers Khalistanis just because of their faith. 
when they can call protesting Muslim women ISI agents, when news channels run smear campaigns calling anyone who is opposed to Modi ji as Naxals, anti-nationals, jihadis, then are you surprised that some people think it's okay to abuse a cricketer on a bad day? or go after an actor because of what he ate 11 years ago, or because of what he said 8 years ago, or simply because he's Muslim. From the Sushant Singh Rajput case, to Deepika's mal chats, to the award wapsi gang, to going after Amir Khan for expressing his concerns about his country, news channels have led the pack of wolves that wants Bollywood to come to its knees in service of the ruling party discourse. News channels have emboldened the worst impulses in us. It encourages us to throw words like Khalistani, Jihadi at anyone you have a problem with or at anyone you're angry with. This is a discourse that urges you to celebrate and gloat, even when scores of people suffer because of a natural calamity. Pakistan has started to earn money Shehbaz ka khazana khali hai. That's why Pakistan has kept its hand in the world. बाढ़ के सहारे कंगाली दूर करने का फॉर्मूला बनाया गया है कंगाली में पाकिस्तान का आटा गीला खस्ता हाल पाकिस्तान डूब रहा है पाक मांगे भारत से भीख पाकिस्तान की हालत खस्ता मोदी जी बचा लो दिस इज द डिस्कोर्स व्हेन नॉट जस्ट पाकिस्तान बट इवन इंडिया हैज लॉस्ट पीपल टू डेवस्टेटिंग फ्लड्स थिंक ऑफ व्हाट दिस न्यूज़ डिस्कोर्स वांट्स यू टू बिकम अनथिंकिंग हार्टलेस हेटफुल ट्रोल्स that's all the nuisance we have for you this week. We'll be back next week. Until then, stay mad. That's the only way. Thank you so much, guys, for watching this episode. If you liked it, please share it with your friends and family. Please check out our news laundry reporting on the whole Arshdeep Wikipedia case. It's a very detailed report. You can find it on newslaundry.com. Remember that we are completely ad-free. We don't take any support from businesses or corporations. We completely depend on your subscription to do reports ground reports, analysis, podcasts, interviews and shows like Nuisance and Tippany. So please support us, log on to newslaundry.com and subscribe to News Laundry. I've also written that the best beef you get where. Okay, I've written about so many things. I used to eat it then, I eat it now.